Help me, please help me take this for this day. This is being reduced by the head of the family. Making it 17. And when we put the results together, these are the figures. Then on him and Japan had 132 votes. Alan Kodu Chilamakin had 95 votes. Joe Dati had 4 votes. Kodu Koku had 3 votes. Ozu Afriya Kodu had 36 votes. Obna Adria Japan had 30 votes. Francis Adenimo had 9 votes. Kofi Kunabia Kodu had 0 votes. Bachi Ajaku had nine votes. Mahmoud Baumia had 729 votes. So when you, you, you ask them to give you five people. So clearly you can see from these figures that Canada Japan is selected among the five. Alan Kodja Martin is one of the five. Ozu Afia Koto is the one of the five. And Mahmoud Baumia is the another one of the five. Then when you come to the field position, two, two people tied. So there's a tie between Francis Adenimo, nine votes, and Boachi Ajakon, nine votes. Meaning we have we have the four for you, and the two have tied. So the party will have to take a decision with try to take in the tie. Thank you very much, Prof. And that's what I have for you. The possibility of the two persons joining the board makes sense. I said that is not possible and it will be unconstitutional under uh, NPP terms. The present arrangement and exercise must produce five and no more than five. Therefore, accordingly, we had earlier put into regulations that in case this should happen, which now you see has happened, next week Saturday, there will be a runoff between the two so that one will by all means win. Or otherwise, we continue to have them contest among themselves until we have won. And that is the essence of a runoff. So a week today, if no one has stepped aside for the other, then you look for another uh, election for the fifth place. At the end of the day, we are going to present five contestants for the grand finale.